Never pass it up for Snack again. I've learned my lesson. Guys, we... It was great is that my title says, let's get some wins, smiley face. Like, you know, let's, let's get some wins. Ah. I, um... I'm on a massive <clears throat> loss streak. It's hard for me to say a little bit, but um, <clears throat> it's the truth. Get some wins, smiley face. Hey, chat, let's get some wins. <laughs> mm. uh, I, I don't know if I, the gold is really good. Yeah, I'm taking it. Hey, what's up, I, uh, ask, ask a Rion. Welcome, dude. Glad you like the content. Bash Relic was probably okay, yeah. I, I don't I don't disagree with the Bash Relic. I think Bash Relic, I think I should take in Bash Relic more often. Yeah, sacrifice the keys makes it harder, it's true. Deadly poison leg sweep. Oof. I think we'd like the deadly poison better, but leg sweep is pretty prime rib. You know what? We're going that. Remove. The right. Okay, okay, okay. So I'll be a thumbnail. <laughs> Maybe I just do some MTG today, guys. Maybe today is an MTG day. My brain's not ready for spire shenanigans. My favorite emo. Absolutely love it. I can't wait to ban all of you guys. I want to ban all of you guys. Every single one of you. Now who's laughing? Yeah, you're right. I just gotta, I just gotta praise Prismatic. I don't know, Trout. You Don't test me. I'm just a man who's seen enough ha-has in his life to ban the whole damn Twitch community. Okay. Dash. Now, do I go for the shop and spend my gold, or do I go for this special elite and probably get my butt kicked in? But at least we get the key, right? Am I right? Actually, look, right here is better. We get no elite, we get a shop, and then we get a late elite, and we can do the special guy later. I like this better. Conservative. Conservative Jeremy. Panache this early. Sorry, I mean, Mall Bank this early could be a pay. Is, it, is this worth buying? So how many floors do I need to climb for this to actually be break even? I need to climb, like, 13... 13 to like 14 floors. So when I'm on the 21st floor, it broke even. And then I have to hold on to it for another, like what, 10 floors to get some. This is totally not worth. But, um, Infinite Blades, not bad. I kind of like Panache, Cloak and Dagger. What if I do Panache, Infinite Blades? It's done. The deed's done. Save it all the way for late game. <laughs> the long, 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 long value train. It stops when you buy it? Really? <laughs> Is that really how it works? The moment you buy it stops? There's no way, dude. That's hilarious. Panache tech, baby, let's go. You know it goes really well with Panache tech and after image. You want to know why? Because after image gives you block for all the little cards you're gonna be playing that are not that great. Damn, this is a tough choice because cloak and dagger is but after image. What am I saying? Tough choice, Kappa. Take this heat set. Tough choice. Yeah, for somebody who's an idiot, it's a tough choice. <laughs> right? <laughs> am I right? 
It's just really bad value. You gotta either break like 14 floors just to break even. It's not very good. Yeah, it breaks you. Yeah, you, it doesn't break if you buy it. It's <laughs> probably hilarious. 11, right? It's 22, 22 plus 5 is uh, 26. This guy has. Alright, I'm down. I'm down, I'm down, I'm down. What's up, CC Super Boy? Okay. Another cloak and dagger. It looks like Panache is about to have a lot of fuel. The question is, I think we upgraded after image, right? And infinite blades. But Nah, let's upgrade these cloak and daggers. I think they're gonna be very important to our overall game plan of panashing the boss to death. I have a lot of upgrades to do if I'm being honest. Yeah, I can kill this guy. I actually got my mud bank as a blessing to save all my gold to activate and just try to avoid shops to go for meats. I end up picking up a career later and bite. Oh my god. Well, that is the dream. Not everybody can be that lucky. You got the highest of rolls. <clears throat> you roll the 20. Uh, Bane's okay, but I want to stick to like a smaller streamlined version. I think we can do it in Elite, no problem, except for Gremlin Knob. Here he is. No, we're fine against this guy. I just need energy, so let's do this. And. Well, this is only. Still a little bit better than a stri two strikes. And this is better than a strike. Not bad. Weaken him. Got to upgrade after There's Panache. We actually get Panache here. Does Panache give me lethal though? So I will get um, 4 damage from the Cloak and Dagger, and then 10 damage from him. That's 14. 14 plus 5 is 19. This guy stays alive. But I'm going to do it anyways just because we have lethal next turn. Last a lot of life there. Dagger spray expertise. Dagger spray is not bad. Okay, we'll do it. Jesus Christ. I was gonna rest. I don't think we rest though. I don't know. Uh, if we rest, I think we're losing so much value. The problem is, I, if I don't have a block for the split thing, I mean, I have a weekend. I'll get the weekend. I think if we upgrade after image. We'll have enough block. Mm, if we upgrade Panache, we'll probably do better against this guy. If we upgrade the Neutralize, we'll make sure he's weakened for the attack. A lot of different things to consider, right? I don't have upgraded Neutralize, so he's probably not going to be weakened for his attack otherwise. I'll have to get lucky. Upgrading Panache gives me a lot more AoE, and I can probably take advantage of that. The problem is there's going to be slimes. It's going to be harder to activate Panache when there's slimes and making it harder for me to hit my, um, my Cloak and Daggers. But I will have Infinite Blades. And then there is upgrading cloak and dagger just to get panache more often, but again, slimes mess that up. No, no, recall is either rest or upgrade. No point in recall because I, I, I'm actually worried about this fight. So I think upgrading after image gives you the most benefit. I think just for like overall block, but it's not enough block to really save me just because yeah slime's really messing my draws anyways i think the best thing for me to do i think neutralize seems low impact but it's probably the best way to make sure i stay alive that's so weird to say but it's not even weird to say it's just it's the truth all right that panache he got neutralized early, which is kind of bad just because he's not going to be weakened for his big. 
the bumper. Which means I'm gonna have to get some good block right now. Or I'm gonna have to do steroid putt dash, which is probably not good enough. So we can do what? 18 plus 11. We're dead. We lost. Yeah, like that, that's the thing. I need to get neutralized on turn two or, or turn three. I gotta turn one, which is pretty bad. We just lost. Well, I know we have dash. Defense. We're not dead, but we got this. We, we're fine. We're fine. This is fine. So he gets down to 83. I want to get a better split. 83, if I do strike, 77. I'm gonna do stereo power for the big split, hopefully. And not the best one, but it will have to do. I could have saved it also for like a big dagger spray. Maybe that was better to save it for dagger spray. This guy splits at 20, this guy splits at actually 17. There's one office split there. And hopefully we can do like a big dagger spray kill that guy. This this at uh, 17 as well. And we've got 14 damage. One, two, three. Yeah, I got Panache here. We actually have Panache here, so I do one, two, three, four. We get Panache, which does 10 damage because the guy in the back. Let him go, baby. I'd be close. All right, we got Glass Knife. And we got uh, Doppelganger, Grand Finale. Okay, let's do Glass Knife. Grand Finale, Panache. Wow, we're going, we're, we're going there. No, no, no. Doppelganger is kind of nice because it does help you with Panache procs and After Image. I think Glass Knife, for sure. Ooh, can no longer rest. This is so Monka S, but it's the best play. I thought I died. I know, I thought I died until I realized I lived with 3 HP and then I was like, oh, this is totally easy. So we're going to have to upgrade a lot of cards and make sure we don't take any damage. Alright, good luck! Consistent panache, baby. Alright, consistency. All right, that's uh, some damage to my face. No big deal. Some region pots. Ooh, so backstab is pretty good for my front loaded damage, but blur is pretty good for not taking damage purposes. Uh, it's a tough choice. I think backstab helps me take less damage because of its front loaded, but also blur. Damn. Damn, it's blur. That's a tough choice. I think they're both interesting. Hello, double panache. Oh my god, I had to do it. I know I can't rest, I know. I could do with these waffle. Be like, hey, max HP, full life. Let's go. But then there's also Welly Plans. Double panache. We're doing it. But we need dodge and roll. We need we need defense, guys. It's very important. Also, we need a region pot. Region pot's pretty good. Removing's pretty good. You know, removing makes panache even better. I'll uh, we just do double panache and not ask questions later. Oh my god, what am I doing? Why am I doing this? We gotta upgrade this. Oh, easy guys. Guys, easy. Oh, guys, easy. Easy, easy. Oh my god, the easiness. Couldn't be easier. Oh my god. No, guys, it's not rip run at all. This is glorious.
believe. Hmm, I, I high rolled that crazy there, but I'm definitely gonna avoid the special elite just for now. I want the panache, but I also like dash. Ah, fuck it. Yeah, I'm avoiding the elite. I'm being very conservative. But Act 3 is gonna, I think... But we have a good shot in Act 3. I've got all achievements tonight. Yeah, I do, man. Yo, Oscar, what's up, man? Thank you for the Twitch Prime this month. Appreciate the support. You're welcome to the germ pool. Footwork. Wow, footwork is very good. Footwork is very good. Slice is good as well, but footwork is very good. These are... We have double dodge and roll. This is extremely good, actually, guys. We have double dodge and roll with footwork. It's, uh... Wow. Come on, dude. Come more panache. Let's go. Oh, let's go. I also want to upgrade all these panaches, of course. Like, I want to upgrade the panaches. I want to upgrade the cloak and daggers. I have a lot of stuff to do. One step at a time. Easy. So piercing well, dag deadly poison. I think piercing was pretty good as a one of. Let's upgrade. I didn't want to recall. Ah, whatever. I got it out of the way. Letter opener and panache. Sign me up. Another footwork. Another dodge and roll. Dodge and roll is gonna be our. It's gonna be everything. It's okay, got the recoil all the way. Letter opener and panache is amazing. Panache here. I'm trying to. Yeah, I'll do this because I, I want to get rid of this guy's artifacts. So I can get the weak. Send like the bad versus heart? It is, but we have after image, right? So if we get one more after image, then I can. Every card I spam against the heart gives me. um. Every card I spam against the heart gives me two H two block. I can block his effects. Yeah, spam decks are bad against the heart. The best way for us to, to mitigate that is to have massive blur or more info bits. Massive blur or to do um double after image. Low on life, monkey S. Problems against waking one? Potentially. This deck, this deck does have a lot of problems. That sucks. There's Panache. A little late, dude. 
a little late, dude. My god, this guy's 10 strength. My god, he's an animal. This guy's an animal. Oh my god, this guy's an animal. Piercing Will. Oh my god, look how beautiful that turn is. Oh my. Piercing me was so clutch there. Probably want more than those. I, that's another after image. Okay, that's oof. Yes. But the problem here is uh Whoa, full HP. No problem. What do we want to get rid of? Oh my lord, they're trying to give me the best, and I'm saying, okay. So if I get rid of glass knife, I get full HP and max HP. Now, Glass Knife is a little bit hedging towards outside of my weaknesses, because right now my weaknesses is I don't do that much front-loaded damage. A lot of it's just spam. Well, Glass Knife is like a nice big front punch to help me um, kill a target, especially with Bag of Marvels, right? But uh, I could give up a regular, like, un infinite blades. I have two infinite blades. I can get rid of one of them and get full life that way. No? So, infinite blades gives me full life, but doesn't give me plus 10 max HP. I think last night with Bag of Marvels is... The problem with Infinite Blaze is that it's not only weak against the Awakened One, it's also weak against the Time Eater. Right? So, this is weak out of 2 out of 3, whereas... Fine. Whatever. 2 out of 3 bosses, my deck is already kind of struggling against. Whatever. It is what it is. I did Fnash first, yeah. I thought maybe I could get it, but there's no way. Hopefully our deck can ramp up in a way that mitigates the weaknesses against the bosses coming up. Like more blurs or big fat malaise. <laughs> Acrobatics is not bad. It helps me find the things I need to find. Um, slice is not bad because slice is just a nice attack which opts to activate panache and activate after image. But we had no card draw. Oh! So, but just drawing a slice right now, like as one of our cards with no card draw, feels bad. Yes, I know it's good for panache, but it, we need card draw. All right, we're gonna upgrade the cloak and daggers, or maybe both after images. Get both after images out of the way. I think it's pretty important. Especially with Blur and first opening hands. Not bad. That's, a, that's an avocado. I call it avocado. Potato, potato, avocado. Whatever you want to call it. I'm going to say piercing well. Could have done letter opener, but I'd rather say piercing well here. Ooh, well, now we're getting punished. Well, they wouldn't have changed this outcome. <sighs> Bro, how does that happen? Oh my god. Okay, I'm just gonna... Sign Look, there's no... Like, it's not cheating, it's just me not wanting to discard my block pot. You know, it's... You know... Eh. That happened more... That happens way too often with me, I think. 
the the, the, the times that that happening is greater than one, and that's too high. That's not even science. That's just rectifying what's good and glorious in the world. Using what's rightfully mine. here. It's pretty poggers. I can do double dodge and roll. Uh, I think dodge and roll might be useful. Nah, fine. Set the gap to get Panache next turn. I just do one shift on this guy. And hopefully we do one shift on this guy and then Panache the rest. Panache into Panache. Uh, we heal the full after this fight anyway, so let's just get this out of the way. And let's do dev- I didn't do infinite blades. Now we're rolling. Now we're rolling. Now th these guys can't really hurt me as much now. I want to set them up to both be Panache next turn. I did too many damage. I did too much damage to the guy in the front because he was going to get that at Panache anyways. So that was my bad. That was my bad. Yeah, the, 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 I never double watched Canaries. I love double Panache. The problem was that it has weaknesses against Time Eater and also against the Weakened One. Like, you can't really do these things in Ascension 20 anymore because, like, the bosses punish you pretty hard. And Ascension 20, you're fighting two bosses at the end. But, like, if this was Ascension 0, you'd go to town with this. Like, like Panache is just pure gas. Look at it. Look at it go. Okay, so let's see what we get here. Hmm, Corpse Explosion is very good. Corpse Explosion is very good. Now, I know it keeps cycling and it sucks, but Corpse Explosion, it covers a lot of weaknesses, I would say. Like, that's kind of bursty. I think it's pretty good against Act 4 Elite. I think Corpse Explosion is pretty good here. Ooh, we got Ring of the Serpent, so we draw at six cards a turn, which helps with Panache, and we don't get the same opening hands, but it's okay. We also get Snekawai, which is seven cards a turn, and we get Confused. I think getting Confused is a little bit bad. Um, mm, hovering Kite? Nah, I think we do Ring of the Serpent here. But it's not just AoE, it's also a, we it's also a Burst. And... It's also burst, but also more poison stacking. And, I, 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 look, Donu and Decca, Corpse Explosion, rewarded. Okay, so let's do um, the special elite finally. And hope that we don't get our ass kicks. But again, our deck's pretty good against the Reptomancer. Perfect block. Look at that. One defense card. Hmm. That's what I like to see. That's what I like to see. The problem here, though, is if I upgrade the app, the infinite blades, my first turn is going to be very, very bad. It's going to be all innate cards. I need anchor or something. Our deck is kind of slow. Um, I don't like that. Imagine Kunai. Yeah, Kunai would be great. 
I think our first runs are really slow though, so we need to try to mitigate that somehow. GG. That's beautiful. I love that. Panache is so. That's so much panache. It's another cloak and dagger, which is really good, right? It's really good with what our deck is doing, but then Noxious Dream Plus. Let's see what Noxious Dream Plus does for us versus, um, you know, Cloak and Dagger again. I think Cloak and Dagger we need it because we need more defense as it is. Well, not, I mean, we're good on defense. We have a lot of dodging rolls. We have footwork. I think it's just more consistent. It's more consistent damage with Panache. I like it. I like it. It does require an upgrade, but. Oh, speaking of upgrade, we can no longer heal anyways, right? Well, we can still heal, but we can't rest. But I feel like we get a lot out of upgrade. Because right now, well, upgrade is bad for the infinite blades, right? We just talked about infinite blades would mess us up. But on the plus side, we get the cloaking daggers, panache upgrades. We get the dodge and rolls. There's some upside. There is some upside. First turn is going to be really bad, though. A rare relic could be um, ice cream on CC top. There's a lot of rare relics. There'd be no reason to do campsites. Yeah, they're right. There's no reason to do campsites at that point. How about 999 on gold? Normality sucks, but can we remove the stuff? Yeah, there is no reason to do it. Yeah, you're right. There is no reason to upgrade. The campfires would be just nothing. I, I, I like that. I like that line of thinking. I don't know why I wasted this go by here, but I, I, I was planning to use it anyways. I mean, if we had shops, I'll do normality, but we don't have shops. I want to get my panaches. Where are they at? There they are. Hey, hello. A couple more blurs in this deck has so much block. That was even before footwork right there. Double after image is... It's something. Yeah, more blurs would be fantastic. Like Nightmare Blur. I think Nightmare Blur could actually be the best way for me to beat Time Eater. Yeah, but they're adding in the music, so I think in the future we're gonna get more music. Like like this. Well, I had lethal. Double strike was lethal. Whoopsies. I don't even know my own damage. Okay. What do we get? Mango, eh? That's not bad. What's up, Mega Crit? How you doing, man? So we got Predator, Blade Dance. I think Predator is okay because we get more card draw, which this deck, I think this deck wants. The more cards we can play, you know, the more choices we have. It's a little expensive, Predator. You think I'll maneuver? I don't know about I'll maneuver here. Because I'll maneuver, you would want to dump that energy into card draw, and I only have acrobatics. I'll maneuver and Predator together would be decent, but. So Blade Dance is like really going. It's really committing to the out. It's it's committing to the out. Uh, sorry, the after image panache play. But the problem is, I don't want to overcommit. Like it will give me a lot of panache procs, but I, I wonder if I'm overcommitting by doing that. I nah, will do it. Let's do it. Bouncing flask. This is gonna hurt. Hope the relic is worth it because this is gonna hurt a lot. My first turns are really bad. I don't have panache either. It's better be worth it because the pain. Of 
Corpse explosion. Holy crap. Ah. Oh, if only I can proc letter opener there. Ah, it feels bad. So that was the case where infinite blades was really good there. Uh, we can't rest, so we're gonna have to get like region pots or something. Like infinite blades would actually game. Ooh, tough finish is a good way to get blocked. I'm a little worried though about how much damage I just took there. Tough finish is okay. I don't. Mm. I guess it makes prepared kind of interesting. Like we can do prepared and get blocked and also ha proc panache. Whoa, uh, I'm not ready for that. I don't know. Hey, what's up, Alex? You being bienvenido. Hola, como estas? Como estas, señor? Given th I have given thought to subscriber icons. I promise I have not partnered yet, so once I get partnered, I will do subscriber icon stuff. I, th I think I was going to make it transformative. I don't know exactly just yet, but once it all comes together, we'll, we'll, we'll do some icons for sure. Hope we get some region pots. Wraith form? I wonder how Wraith form is doing for us. Nah. I mean, we could mitigate the dexterity loss with after image, but it doesn't do it doesn't do enough. It's just not good enough. Try our glasses, yeah. I think like golden glasses for like a one year, two year, that'd be cool. I want to make that an emo. The glasses. How bad is it? It's pretty bad, Twash. It's uh, the heart is really rough. Act four is is definitely a challenge. I don't know. I'm not sure why, but uh, they're reviewing the partnership here. I've been checking the email every day. Keeping track of it. It'll happen. No rush, no biggie. Anyways, um uh, Jeff, maybe 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 you're uh, playing ironclad in a way that isn't helping you. I don't know. Like are you what's going what happens with Ironclad? Are you doing too much offense, not enough defense? I think we need one input in place in opening hands. Oh, shit. Yo, thank you for the switch front. That's your coin. Appreciate the support, man. We're doing this just because we need... Uh, we, need the, we need the keys, but we're going to take damage. The burns are not going to be fun. I like that. I like the the blur here. I really like the blur here. I need my footwork. Does the boot apply to? Does he do five damage or only one damage? Uh, the, there's, oh, there. got the weaken though. And by doing acrobatics, we cycle back into Blur quicker, potentially. I think we're good. I think once you get past turn 1, 2, and 3, or like just 1, 2, we're like our deck does a lot of block. It's very strong, but... It's just turn 1 that's kind of a pain. And when you can't rest, having a painful turn 1 is not good. Yeah, boot works because it's changeable, nothing else. I guess it's only boot. It's only the boots. Owie. Owie. I 
I don't even did I, I didn't even crack his metallic size there. <laughs> oh my god, 45 again, dude. You're crazy. You're nuts. Praying for the blood idol. Yeah, blood idol would be nice. Oh, hello, Blur. Okay, we need to heal somehow, some way. I don't know how we're going to heal here. Play dance plus. I mean, we can just full commit, I suppose. But I think piercing was probably better. I'm scared. I'm scared. I don't know how useful Panache is when you're not... Take the key. Okay, give me full heal. Oh, Spaghetti, what's up, man? That's all. I still want to do enough damage to kill him. But Panache and after uh, letter opener don't. Okay, this is good. He doing it regardless. What? This guy is savage. Oh no! <gasps> no, I rather. Oh god, oh, mistakes were made, oh god. Okay, we need a full heal ASAP from like the event, oh god. You know, we're gonna get Waffle, no, we already saw Waffle. Don't panic, nobody panic, nobody panic. Everything's good. No panic. Man, everything's good. Oh my god, Malleable actually... Okay. I didn't want the curse and then I ended up taking a mass... Oh my... Dude. I never had the fight last this long. Because my deck... He's actually pretty good against my deck. Hmm. Did we try to get rid of his attack here? Oh, it worked out. Oh, nice. Ooh. Panache kills him here. Oh, never mind. It's one close, so close to Panache there. Okay, we need like a full heal. And Tropic Bruce gonna give me a, okay. The finisher's very good, but Malaise counteracts like the after uh, time meter, and Malaise is too good. So is finisher though. Transformer card. What do we get? Okay. Okay, I need, I need to go to the shop because I need to find some kind of healing. Ah, fuck me. Backflip is very good, though. I, I'm happy about the backflip. No healing for me, though. I guess the Tropic Blue is going to be the, <laughs> the, the last out. Ghost in the jar. Well, a lot of stuff we can do here. Let's remove a strike. Bye, backflip. <laughs> Apotheosis, kind of decent, I would say. Yeah, I don't mind Apotheosis. Uh, okay, let's remove a strike. Backflip. Ghost and Jar, yeah, it's, it's... The thing about Ghost and Jar, though, is that I'm trying to use Entropic Brew. I guess that helps my first turn one.
Lantern helps my burst my turn one a little bit, yeah. If I get card draw, I, I kind of like Apotheosis here. Yo, Rap Bell, welcome to the stream, buddy. No, not accuracy. I think Apotheosis is so expensive, that's the problem. But if it can upgrade my panaches or upgrade my dodge and rolls, it's pretty good. You can make me live a little bit longer because that's. Do I have enough time for Apotheosis? I don't know. I mean, I think if I just get it off, I'm doing a lot better. Hmm. I guess I can. I don't know if I buy accuracy. I can't buy accuracy. Okay, we need. Oof, this guy. Holy crap, dude. This, this doesn't get easier. It just doesn't get easier. I guess we do ghost here. Let's see what we get here. Region pot, maybe? Hmm. Unfortunate. Unfortunate. Piercing. I got it. I got to stay fully alive here. Well, if I do survivor, I get tough bandages, right? So I'm getting three plus. I'm getting five. Sixteen block. 16 block gives me up to 41. This guy's doing 40 damage. Okay, that's fine. I think we do acrobatics here. So Blade Dance gives me... Gives me eight block. Eight block puts me in thirty-two. Thirty-two is enough. No, no, no. Is it? Let me see. I can play my lace for zero. Let's go. It's the turn. Let's get him up. I think I get as much block as possible here. Problem is that how do you go to the jar to survive turn one and two? So I won't have that for the elite. I can't even afford to take any of this. Yeah, but I'm too low in life. Just <laughs> this is a death sentence. And there's no more events. Like the shop needs to be my last out for healing and or the event. I didn't get either. Finisher's pretty damn good, but all right, JP. Ready for the head? I guess, yeah, the head gives me setup time. The thing is, um... Yeah, I don't... Finishers, it's, it's not play. Poison pot versus... Mm. Okay, we got some setup time. Best case scenario for me. Should have kept the poison pot for catalyst. That was my bad. 
I don't have, I guess Panache is a way to kill him, but it's not very fast. But consistent block is something, oh, my bad. I can do consistent block for sure. That's not very good. That's not a very good turn for me. I want to do infinite blades. I can't though, I have to do blade dance. Again, although this is a good turn for us. There's 16 block. So each one of these is um Blaydance is eight block. Blaydance is eight block. And this is six this is this is more, this is eighteen block. Let's do the shifts first and see where we're at. Eighteen block. Uh, hmm. We're dead. How the weekend? Damn. RP. Eight. Yeah. Nah, it's not enough. This is eight plus six. It's only a. F 14 block is 18 block. This catalyst was a curse. If this catalyst was anything else, probably I can do it. Close. More weakening would have been nice. Damn. RP. Yeah, it's 14. Damn. I mean, I think not being able to heal and taking that much damage was like. Because the thing is, we went for the keys, right? And. In order to get the key, we went here. Like, if I was trying not to go for the keys, I avoid this. I stay healthy. But because I'm trying to get the key and I'm also have can't heal, I take this. And that just messes me up. But I, if, if I wasn't going for keys, I go on the right, avoid all the elites. And I probably beat this no problem, right? I can beat Donu Deca. And I'll be healthy enough to beat the next one. It's close.